friends. Welcome back to Llama Mama Kayla's Yarn Tube. I'm Kayla. Thanks for stopping by and hanging out with me today. Today is just going to be a very informal, not that my videos are very professional anyway, but just an informal chatting it up video. It is Whip Wednesday, but I haven't started a new whip or anything like that. I do have a project that I am currently working on, and I'll tell you about that in just a moment. But First off, I want to say that I appreciate you all so very much. Yesterday, we put up the video of my dental fundraiser of these cups that Big Daddy is doing. It's these cups right here. Um, and, by the way, I'm drinking Oh Fudge Chocolate Coffee. So, <laughs> I hope it has lots of caffeine in it and will help my headache. We put that um, video up yesterday morning, and you guys were awesome. You guys are so awesome. And lots of people were ordering cups. And um, my sweet friend Jennifer at Cinnamon Stitches, she and I had talked a while back about doing a GoFundMe. And I told her, <laughs> I told her that, um, I don't know, I just really wasn't comfortable just taking donations. I don't know. I mean, yes, she's correct. It's a pride thing. And I'm sorry about that. <laughs> but anyway, she decided that she was just going to do that anyway. And I appreciate her for it. I do. I appreciate her so very much. I love me some cinnamon stitches. She's my girl. Okay. So anyway, um, so we put up that opened up the Etsy shop with that cup and Jennifer put up that GoFundMe and you guys just blew us away okay like <laughs> I was just <laughs> I was just in shock I was overwhelmed I was just um like in disbelief I don't know I was just <laughs> very much overwhelmed okay and I told Big Daddy I was like my my chest like I my chest was beating so hard like my heart was just beating and I was feeling real jittery and just I felt like my heart was just gonna pop out of my chest it was beating so fast I told Big Daddy I said, jokingly I said I might need to go to the ER and he said we're about to call an ambulance because I got cuts to make <laughs> But anyway, guys, you did just blow me away, and I appreciate that so, so very much. Now, you know, if you're not in a position that you could order a cup or give to the GoFundMe, it's all good. Watch a video. Watch it. Let some ads play. That that helps a lot, too, okay, guys? So just watching this video is helping, okay? And I appreciate you all so very much regardless, okay? Because whether you ordered a cup, or gave on the GoFundMe, or watched a video and let the ads play, you're still helping, okay? So anyway, guys, um, and then something has, something needs to be done to the Etsy shop. I think it's a tax type thing. Something needs to be filled out for the taxes, and so the shop is shut down for the moment until we can get that straightened out, and it's probably just some information needs to be put in. Um, my son Dakota, who is the one that would help do things like that, he's at work today. and He's teaching um, macaroon classes tonight, so he won't get home till about 10 tonight. And then he's going to call me, and we're going to see what needs to be done. He can log into my Etsy from his house and um, see what needs to be done or whatever. Anyway, but in the meantime, people are getting refunds on the cups left and right. People are requesting refunds. So I told Big Daddy, I said, do not print any shipping labels. Because when he prints a shipping label, it's going to automatically take the money from us. You know, it's, we're gonna, it's going to automatically take the shipping costs from us. I said, don't print any shipping labels yet. Because um, people are getting refunds left and right. And it's refunded like, I don't know, 100 cups or more. Yeah, and so I told him, you're liable to print a shipping label for something that's been refunded already. So just tell him to hang on. So if you haven't gotten a refund for your cup, just give us a few days. Let us get this situated. Um, tonight, 
like I said, Dakota's going to look at that and see what needs to be done, and then we'll put that information in there, and then it may still take a day or two. Um, sometimes things say like two to three or two to five business days, but we'll get it straightened out, you know, whatever it is, we, we'll get that straightened out. So, you know, if you feel like you need to get a refund, go right ahead, do it. <laughs> but um, I appreciate it if you would just, you know, give us a few few days there to get that worked out and figure out what's going on. But, um, and then today, excuse me one second. I feel like I really need some caffeine in me. Um, today, I woke up with a horrible, horrible headache and was just nauseated and then started throwing up. But my head was hurting so bad. And I think it's weather related. It was dreary, outside looking, overcast. And then we had lots of thunder. And I'm not sure if it actually rained because... After I had thrown up several times, I took some Zofrin, and I was just like, I called Big Daddy. I said, I'm going to bed. You know, don't call me. I'm going to bed. <laughs> and I went and got in the bed and just laid there, you know, in the dark with my eyes closed. And I could hear it just thundering and thundering. And um, it sounded like it was storming outside, but I'm not for sure if it was raining or not because I did not get up. And so, and then once I did get up, I still have a slight headache, but it's not as bad as it was this morning. But I think it's weather related. I just, um, I've been having that a lot lately. And um, I don't know, I just feel like it might be weather related. But anyway, guys, um, that's what's going on with me. I have a video that I was recording for you guys working on my bunny sweater i was recording showing you guys how to put um panels together how to put two panels together and add an arm and so you know it doesn't have to be that same kind of panel it could be any kind of panels and um so i'm working on that video i just got to the point where um i, I couldn't work on it today <laughs> i just could not work on that today with the headache that i had so but hopefully tonight I'll be able to finish up that video and get it out for you guys. So since I couldn't work on that, and I, I can't work on that sweater anymore, um, I have this sweater that I'm also working on. Same style, same thing. Um, this is going to end up being a sweater. And so I'm doing, I'm using on the around this one, I'm using... Um, the Red Heart Retro Stripes. Love that colorway. And I love how it's just, you know, working up differently all the way around it. I don't know what I got going on here, but um <laughs> so eventually this is going to be a sweater. So I was working on this and this was actually in here. And I was sitting at my desk and I just didn't feel like getting up to come in here to get it. But my purple yarn was at my desk. <laughs> So I have to do a back panel for this sweater. So that's what I started crocheting on. So I'm just crocheting on my back panel for um, this sweater. And so I'm making the bunny sweater. I'll just go ahead and tell you. This sweater is going to be a unicorn. Um, a unicorn sweater. And I can't wait to get these done. And then there is a third one for sure that I'm going to make. And it's the cow. I want to make the cow sweater. So anyway, um, that's what I'm doing today. It's just a little bit of crocheting on this. Um, I didn't need anything too heavy or that I had to think about too much. With the headache that I've had. <laughs> um, but hopefully tonight, if my headache subsides, I can get in there and record finish recording up those sleeves, how to do the sleeve, um, putting panels together. So that's my plan. That's my plan. I do want to say um, thank you to everyone who, big, big thank you to Jennifer at Cinnamon Stitches for opening that GoFundMe. A big thank you to any content creator who shared my 
or our video about the cups and dental funding. I appreciate that very much. Um, I appreciate, I just appreciate you all so very much. You just have no idea. I love you guys so very much. I just, um, I'm sorry that I've ended up with such a headache and haven't been able to function today. <laughs> I haven't been able to function today. It's just been rough. Okay. Hopefully, this weather will pass and I'll feel better tomorrow, hopefully. Hoping it starts clearing up some tonight. It's not as bad as it was, the headache. It's not as bad as it was earlier. So, I hope I get some crochet time on that sweater. But, I had to do the back panel for this anyway. And since I couldn't crochet on the sweater without, you know, I got to film crocheting on it. So I thought, well, I'll just start this back since the purple was laying there. And I was too lazy to get up and come in here and get the front panel. <laughs> do you guys ever do that? You know where your project is, but you just don't want to get up and go get it. <laughs> so what are you guys working on today? Do you have a um, special project you're working on? A new wheel or a project you're about to finish up just whatever it doesn't have to be crochet or knitting it can just be whatever it is that you're enjoying working on that is uh, that's the back side and this is the front side of my back of the sweater <laughs> I think this sweater is going to be really cute and cool. Um, I can't wait to get them done. I'm glad that I'm working on them now and getting them done before winter. So that as soon as it gets cool, I can wear them. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. I was so excited yesterday and I told Big Daddy last night that... Um, once we transfer, well, actually, I was thinking that we would be transferring the Etsy funds over and stuff like that, and that um, I was going to call the, the dentist today and get an appointment for next Monday, because I have a doctor's appointment for Monday, and so I was going to get a dentist appointment for about two hours after my doctor's appointment. So I could go and, you know, start all over with the x-rays and the estimate and all that kind of stuff. But since everything has happened, I need to wait before I make that appointment to, you know, <laughs> let things happen. <laughs> let things happen because after um, all the refunds and stuff that's been going on, um, I don't know how much is even going to be there to transfer over. So we'll just wait. And see but hopefully I was really hoping I could get in next Monday because I want to get this done like ASAP okay soon as possible but we'll see we'll see what happens well guys um I am going to just crochet on this back panel since it's a mindless thing crocheting on the front panel would be a mindless thing at this point too but um, I'm just going to crochet on this for a little bit until after Big Daddy gets home. And then once he gets settled um, back there in the den doing his thing and I'm in the parlor doing my thing, I'm going to get back to recording on that video about the putting in the sleeves. So hopefully that video will be coming out. Hopefully I can get it done tonight and the video will come out tomorrow, guys. That's my plan. It's my plan, man. Well, I love you guys, and I'm going to let you all get going, and I hope you have a blessed day. Enjoy your day, and remember, it is a beautiful day to crochet. Bye, friends. Sassy girl. She, she finally come and laid right here in front of me. She's right here. <laughs> come here, sassy girl. Ugh. Let go. Let go. Grab nothing. There's <laughs> one spoiled cat right here. One spoiled cat. <laughs> yep. 
You gonna tell him how spoiled you are? They can probably see it. Y'all can see how spoiled she is, can't you? <laughs> yeah, you spoiled. Spoiled cat. Little fat cat. Are you little fat cat? <laughs> Alright, we'll get in play with Phoebe. I can't put her down because Phoebe will jump on her. <laughs> because I was holding her. Phoebe's like, I told you not to let her hold you. <laughs> oh, sassy. Yeah. Here, go this way. Go this way. <laughs> 